Hey, it's Rich. You know, I pray each and every day that the next president of the United States will be able to be effective and bring us together. But here's what I also know. No matter who gets elected in November, the underlying conditions of this country will remain. Too much mistrust, a lost sense of hope, growing inequities and disparities. That's why on Wednesday, August 28th at 7 p.m., we're holding our own civic convention. Because I believe, and so many Americans believe, that we need a new path forward. But it's going to have to be a new civic path, where we can come together in our local communities amid our real differences and figure out what we can agree on, where we can get in motion and start to take action, and where we can grow our belief in ourselves and one another that we can actually come together and get things done. You know, I was recently in Kentucky doing work much like this, and a man said to me, you know, Rich, this isn't about Republicans or Democrats. This is about we as Americans coming together and moving forward together. And in Ohio, a woman turned to me and said, thank God we're finally getting past the culture wars. Here's the reason why. Because we are no longer focused on divisive politics, but on issues that really matter to people in their daily lives. Issues like youth, our public schools, homelessness and affordable housing, and senior care, things that matter to each of us each and every day. All across America, this new civic path is catching fire. People are stepping forward. They're coming together. They're getting work done. They're demonstrating that there is a new sense of hope spreading throughout this country. That's why we're holding our civic convention to lift up the idea that we need a new civic path forward, to highlight the voices of Americans from all across the country who are doing this good work. We're holding the Civic Convention to call you and me and others forward to say enough. Let's build together. Join us Wednesday, August 28th at 7 p.m. for the Civic Convention.